Why hello there and welcome back to Garnet Creation's playthrough of One Piece Odyssey and as promised we are continuing through the Thunderhead Ruins. So let's go find out what this thing is. Oh there's the the Colossus is in the middle. What is this? Apparently we need to turn off the glowing walls to get to the Thunder Colossus. Is there a switch to stop the electricity? I mean, there was a device to electrify the floor, so there could be a switch to turn it off. Okay, let's start by searching the nearby rooms. Yeah, this is, look, when I was looking at the map in the last one, I was like, oh yeah, I probably gotta go like turn all this off or something. Let's just start right here. And then that way too, let's get this guy. Zoro's fan club as I call him. Isa powered up. Okay, beat the powered up Isa before a crew member is knocked out. This might be more than I can handle. This doesn't look good. Seems like I should help. <laughs> Alright, TP charged. Sorry guys, but I gotta take you down fast. If nobody touches Nami. <laughs> Yeah, I was going to say just a sword strike. <laughs> and we'll get that bonus. 660 plus 3610. Bam! Level up! Man, might hit level 20 before we get out of here. <laughs> Yeah, everybody's gaining levels. Like, <laughs> okay. Let's see. Uh, if the light keeps going, that means there are more devices up top. Ah, you're probably right. Oh, yeah. Okay. Grab that. Grab that. Just make sure. Checking things out here. Switch the chopper, please. Here we go. Just how far does this hole go? If only we could get the device. This is a pretty long hole. Okay, let's hurry. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we finally made it out. <laughs> He's so funny. Alright, let's see if we can get this guy. It's so fluffy. <laughs> okay, we got uh, critical strike. Alright, dragon twister it is. And a punch. Punch to the face. <laughs> we won this fight. Sure did. Okay. Hit that. Hit that. Okay. And then looking around. And I'm not going to worry about plugging in any cubes we find until right before we go fight the, the Colossus. Get back here. <laughs> We're circling each other. Okay. Bonus crit. Let's go. Oh, uh, you know what? Since there's like multiples, I'll just we'll use uh, Zoro and Luffy's attacks and clean up these guys. Alright, Gatling. Gatling good it is. Okay, 940. Nice. Chopper leveled. Okay. Nope. Oh. I don't want to do that just yet. There we go. Oh, I thought there might be something. Is there anything I can, uh. 
I can bust. Nope. All right, going up. Oh, okay. I was like, "Hey, it's the switch." Oh, okay. Before, let's see what's in here. Uh, excite apple. Okay. So now on this one, I'm guessing that we just gotta. We're gonna turn it once. And I'm gonna see if I can turn it one more time. Of course, there's a switch here. The wall of light is getting thinner. Okay. I'm gonna push it one more time. Okay. Oh, okay, that one doesn't. It has to stay stay like that so we can get through the door. Alright, just check in to make sure I'm not missing anything. I will take that and I'll take that. Take that. Alright, let's check out below. Going down. Here we go. Alright, that was the most difficult ladder ever. But we did it. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's tap this one. Okay. Got weakened it a little bit further. That closes the door. Okay, I pushed it. Isn't that the same one we saw on the beach? No, you were attacked by the fire colossus. This one is different. Yeah, as good as lightning, because. Let me do this real quick. Yeah, there we go. Don't think we can go that way, but just in case. Okay. Let's fight. Let's fight this guy. This is what I love about RPGs. It's just I don't know why, but it's just always so satisfying to to fight. <laughs> right now, I feel like we're a little overpowered, but uh, I know we'll probably get to a point where. That won't be that big of an issue, um, and then it'll catch up, and then we'll start uh, struggling a bit more. <laughs> That's how these games always go. They they build you up to crush you. Nice sword work, Zoro. I'm pretty good with that gun, too. Still haven't <laughs> really used them. <laughs> okay. Now to go this way. He's been, yeah, I was, uh, had a feeling he was going to turn, so... There we go. Critical hit time! Here we go. I'm just going to start skipping some of these intros. Alright, let's go. Oh, yeah. There we go. And boom. I just did the speed up to go a little bit quicker. <laughs> That way we can uh, we can we can fight and then keep it moving. Okay, treasure chest. Nice. Okay, and then going up. Ooh, a ladder. There's the device. What's with the hole in the ceiling? Does the Colossus get in through there? Haha, <laughs> maybe. You almost never see a Colossus outside, though. Man. Doesn't look like we can climb that wall. Yeah, I was gonna say, but that's because we gotta open this door. Alright. Let's go push the button. Alright, blue brick. Turn that one. And one more. Give it one more turn. And that should deactivate another part of it. The light around the Colossus is weakening. Alright, three down, one to go. What's with all what's with this wall of light though? 
Does it protect the Colossus, or is it sealing the Colossus in? I don't know. I'm starting to, starting to wonder about audio here. Okay, Zoro's cube fragment. Alright, here we go. Let's fight. Bring it on. Um, I'm gonna use since he's a lightning, let's uh let's actually do pistol. Oh, okay, that, that almost had him. Ooh. Oh yeah. No uh no damage there. Oh, I guess I see it's on speed up. I was like, why is it going so quick? <laughs> Alright. And that should be the end of it. I always thought her weather baton was like one of the coolest things, like how she can take it apart to reconfigure. You're a scary lady, Nami. Am I? You haven't seen anything yet. Uh, we got a trophy called Victor. Yup. <laughs> Okay, so far in this one, there hasn't really been um, any breakable walls, you know? Okay. Making sure I'm not missing anything. Okay. Let's see. I'm surprised there wasn't something around the side of the door. And... Before we go any further, let's get the treasure chest. Okay. Alright, here we go. We're going to deactivate the last one and then we're going to get the Colossus fight. Alright, that should bring it down. Okay, the wall of light is weakening. Which means we'll face the Colossus of these ruins soon. I don't really want to meet it. <laughs> it looks sad. This should be the last one. Now let's face the Colossus of these ruins. I'm going to turn it one more time. Just for fun. Okay. Kind of looking across, looking around. Anything else we can uh, we can get while we're uh, oh, before we do, like I said, now now we'll go in and let's go ahead and uh, plug in all the ones we found. Oh wait, I have to go back, go back. Okay. That's all we got. Alright, let's get this guy. Take bad out. Punch him in the head. <laughs> and Dragon Twister, these two. Okay. Got it. Alright, let's see what he's... So this is a Thunder Colossus. It has an old crest just like the Fire Colossus. So we just need to take this guy down, right? Here we go. It appears that this Colossus can control lightning. Lightning won't work on me. Okay, you take it from here, Luffy. Yeah, yeah I was going to say, like, you're fighting too, Usopp. <laughs> Alright, let's see, 1491. Yeah, let's hit him with, uh... Oh, wow. Beat Thunder Colossus with Luffy. Alright, let's see how much damage he does. Oh, wow, he doesn't do anything. Um, let me, I'm gonna attack him. <laughs> I'll... Hmm.
Can I? Oh, too bad there's not like a. I don't really need anything though. Let me use Nami and see how much she does. 71. I'll, I'll try. Okay. Alright, I hope he doesn't beat him. Oh, he healed. He healed me. Alright, is he gonna go for Luffy or is he gonna hit the whole party? This could be bad. Oof. Not too bad. Oh, no. Alright, I'll hit him. I'm just gonna whittle him down until Luffy is, uh... Oh. Alright, we'll attack him. Okay, and then hopefully next turn I should be able to use Luffy. Do I have, like, a... Okay, good. Whew. Come on. No. That's so funny I got paralyzed on that one. Okay, so... I'm gonna do bazooka. <laughs> Just for fun. Boom! Got him. Hehehe. <laughs> Thunderclaw's power, Thunderclaw's record. Lightning won't work on me. You guys are amazing. Nice. 18. 17. 18. 18. 17. And if we get a chance, we're gonna go, we're gonna go party. Oh, I was like, wait, do I get all those? <laughs> Can't be good. That was interesting. What was that? Audio, you're awesome. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> that's right. I forgot to tell you that I'm a grab grab fruit user. <laughs> Anything I can hold in my hand, I can take and control. As you can see, if I if I grab some lightning, this is what happens. I can't grab anything living, though. Also, I won't be able to handle the endless lightning strikes at the cave entrance. I have only two hands, you know. I only have two hands, you know. I'll block any attack that I can see coming, though. That's right, if you're with me, they can pour on all the attacks they want, and I'll defend you. Thanks, Adio. I underestimated you. Yeah, I saw you put yourself in danger to protect the crew. And I called you suspicious. Sorry about that. Don't worry about it. It's my payback for Lim giving you trouble. What? This is... What's up, Audio? I just picked up something quite rare. If I'm not mistaken, this is something extremely important for exploring Wofford. I want to check it out. I'll let you know as soon as I learn anything. Oh, okay. <laughs> Obtain Thunder Colossus Core. About guest characters. As you progress through the episodes, characters other than something will join your party. <laughs> Ooh, here comes the Navy. 
Oh, it looks. Ah, yeah, I was right. Smoker. Tashigi. What's that light? I don't know, but the tidal currents in the region have gotten much stronger since it appeared. It could indicate a storm. What is he up to? I wonder if that was because it was depowered or defeated, you know? So the first Colossus has fallen. This was unexpected. What do you want to do? If by some chance it wakes up, it'd be trouble. But it's not like the lid's been removed yet. <laughs> okay. Regain strength. Return to Audio's house. Alright. Time to go party! <laughs> okay. Oh, did we, uh, did we get anything? Nope, doesn't look like it. Oh, hey, that spot down there is where we came from. Very cool. Take that. Alright, doesn't look like there's anything else right there. Ah, there's something up there, though. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> I was, like, trying to get over there. There we go. Okay. I think we already did this one. Yeah. We'll go ahead and save. Alright. That's a pretty big cube. Will it fit back in our bodies? Right, how am I supposed to get this in my body? I don't know. I've never seen a cube uh, being returned. Do we eat it? I can't eat this much. It doesn't look very good either. Let's just go back. We can think it over. Yeah, I was wondering what was going to happen. Because it looks like we, you know, got a bunch of stuff. But then nothing came back right away. So we'll have to see. Alright. I don't see anything, so we're good. There's Pikachu down there. <laughs> it's like... It's like just the coloring alone, that's all. I don't think he sees us. Eh, we'll just leave him alone. These guys are pretty weak. Okay, we already... In any case, it seems like the lightning research was fairly advanced at those ancient ruins. I see. It must be significant if you're saying so. You studied at Weatheria, after all. So they were able to make that Colossus based on that research? Yes. Most likely, it's incredible technology. I'm trying to try to run and read at the same time. I did it though. Anyway, we have to do something about the big cube. Yeah, but what? Well, we just have to test different things. Alright, we're back. What are you doing? Quit it! Just stay still. I'll put the cube back now. <laughs> What's wrong with you guys? Knock it off. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm helping you, duh. <laughs> it looks like the big cube won't be absorbed, even if you force it. Sorry, but I don't understand. Ask Lim about this cube. Oh, well, let's find Lim. Finally. Alright, where's... Where's Lim? Might as well grab some stuff. A 
I'm like she's gotta be up in the in the treehouse, I'm guessing. Alright, let's go up here. Up we go. Yeah, I'm thinking she's upstairs. Or I could, I should have probably checked the the tree hole because isn't that where her bed is? Oh yeah. My bad. Oh wait, wait. I don't think she might not even be in here because the arrow's pointing like way over there. You get uh, where's Lynn? Well, there's a circular beach in the in inland sea. She often she's often there. Go take a look. Oh, is that where the the parrot is? Why don't we make camp and rest here for now? I don't think it will be too late if we begin looking for Lim afterwards. Oh, okay. Fine. All right. Yeah. Actually, let's change up the party too. Okay. I'm hungry. Where's the food? That girl might come back, so we need to rush. Sony. Yeah, why don't we rest here? Party! <laughs> I wasn't really trying to hide it. I'm a grab grab fruit user. <laughs> you should build us out of that one, Audio. Thanks. What can you do with that ability? Well, they're gauntlets, so I can grab things and block things. It's pretty limited. Huh, I see. What is it, Zoro? Now I understand why that bullet ricocheted. You deflected it with your ability. Hey, it's rude to re reveal other people's tricks. <laughs> That's funny. It's like... Like, hold on a sec. Okay, uh, change efforts, yes. Okay, so let's put, go back to. Alright, go back to our new one. Okay. Okay, there we go. Alright, let's talk to everybody. I just saw Lim heading for the Inland Sea. Okay. Woo! Getting these cubes isn't easy. I have to train harder so I can cut anything, even lightning. There are some plants I've never seen before. I might be able to make some new pellets and weapons. I'll need to, just, eh, need to secure more ingredients. I'll walk around the island later. Oh, we're getting a lot of stuff. I can't translate if you want to talk to the animals on this island. The animals here are similar to the ones we saw on the Sky Island Shiki took us to. Hang that large cube, hand that large cube to Lim. You'll be able to get quite a bit of your strength back. Alright, and then be the... Yeah, sure, check it out. Okay, combat log. Okay. Alright, where's the... Okay. How do we do the... Have a party? Yes. Let's do it! <laughs> and then we'll go find Lim. <laughs> Chopper. <laughs> His dance. <laughs> yeah, so every chance we get, we gotta go... Party! <laughs> okay. Oh, it must be true of Chopper saying it. Lim, where are you? <laughs> Okay. Look, isn't that her by that small beach? 
Oh, I was say, cool. I can actually go that way. Let me take a look. Yeah, that's Lim, all right. Oh yeah, there she is. Let's go grab this real quick. Anything else to grab? Yeah, we'll go right here. We'll go to where the exclamation is. Okay, what's she doing? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can. Um, I want to help audio. Audio is always right and never wavers. I know he'll be able to help wa Wofford. Unfortunately, I still do not trust him. The only thing that backs up his actions are his words. Hmm. B -b but Oh, there you are, Lim. Lim, these big cubes won't go back into our bodies. You know why? Lim? Oh well, I'll help you a little. <laughs> Give me the cube. A cube this large can't be absorbed naturally. If it's integrated, its true strength won't be fixed without experiencing the contents of the memory once. What do you mean? It will be faster if I just show you. Oh, this is interesting. Oh, where are we? Like, so she, like she said memory cores? Like, are we going to get to... Uh, wow, the scenery changed all of a sudden. Well, what is this place? Solve the mystery of the cube. Right, let's see. They're not going to drop. And Olasa cube hardly weighs anything. Oh, interesting. Seems like somehow we're in a completely different place now. You can use the Olasa cube as you like here. Such sure is a strange sight to behold. Do you like it? That rock is floating. What is this place? These are all the Olasic cubes. Cubes that contain records. Audio is gone. He was just with us. Right now, this place is a space that manages your memories. Audio can't come here because there are no memories of him here. Alright, first, let's go. Let's talk to Rob. The shape of the island... The light pillar that reaches the heavens and the tower ruins. They all match the legendary island of Wofford. But there are still many things we don't know. The text didn't mention the mysterious col colossi or the research facilities. There's still more we can study. I know it's strange, but it feels familiar. Okay. And then what's this? About the pirates. A strange pirate. It's been a while since pirates should lash it up. They're so weird with their strange outfits and stupid stories. They might be quiet now, but pirates are hostile by nature. I want to drive them away as soon as possible, but Audio said not to. There's no way they can be good for Wofford. Okay. And let's talk to... Let's see what happens. You can freely use the cube in this place. Here we... Wow, what a strange place. Strange? Well, you can call it whatever you want. What are you planning on starting here? This is just a stopover. We'll be going to the world of memory next. World of memory? Yes, a world created from your memories. World of memory? What are we going to do there? 
Follow your accomplishments. You take whatever accomplishments you made in the past and repeat them in the world of memory. However, the world of memory, called Memoria, is made from your memories. Many phenomena you experience might be recreated differently than how they actually happened. You know how fuzzy memory can be. Memoria? I don't really get it. It'd be faster for you to experience it than for me to explain it. Alright, here we go. The cube was absorbed and the straw hat's strength returned. Alright, we got Gun Gun Bazooka, we got Gun Gun Bullet, Tiger Trap, 3000's Worlds, Lion Song, Thunderbolt Temple, Make, Usopp's Rubber Band of Doom, Expanded, Usopp's Hammer, Exploding Star, Usopp Pound, Cook, New, Bassus uh, Cote, Vio Shot, Cloven Rosio, Dos Flores Grab. Dang, we got a lot. <laughs> and here we go we're going in <laughs> the straw high pirates began their exploration of offer to recover the strength that was lost defeated the Colossus with audio's help and succeeded in retrieving their first cube But things took an unexpected turn. Next chapter. Memories of the Desert Kingdom, Alabasta. I said it back then. That I would surpass you. Chapter one clear. Trophy earned. Oh, we're gonna actually get to Oh, this is so cool. Oh man. <laughs> I was not expecting any of this. Like I don't know anything about the game and what but this is so cool. <laughs> Nanohana. Wow. <laughs> Luffy. <laughs> oh, is this Alabasta? Oh yeah, Chopper was in, was after that, right? Because if we got... Wait. Home of my sweet Vivi. Is this really inside our memories? No, Chopper. I thought Chopper was there. That's amazing. It's exactly like the real Nano... Nanohana. So this is Alabasta. What kind of adventure did you have here? I mean, that's going to be a long story. Can you remember what you did in Alabasta specifically? Yeah, we saved Princess Vivi's kingdom. We came to Alabasta to save my Vivi. Yeah, because Baroque Works was trying to take over. That was what it was called. Baroque Works was trying to take over. And we fought to stop them. Many people ended up getting hurt, but we managed to defeat Crocodile and prevent all out war. I think that is clearly the answer. Defeating this Crocodile, you mentioned, was the biggest accomplishment you achieved here. So I just need to punch that guy again? <laughs> <laughs> That's easy. Now that we know what we need to do, let's get going. Hold on. There's something important I haven't mentioned yet. This world was created from your memories, but that doesn't mean the exact same things will happen. What do you mean? This place was made from our memories. That's exactly why you know how fuzzy memories can be. 
Plus, the events that will happen and the enemies that appear should be tougher than they were. Huh? How does that work? To put it simply, as you became stronger, so did the enemies from your memories. Oh boy. What? Really? So Crocodile got stronger as we got stronger? Hold on, aren't we weaker now than we were before though? Oh, that's a good point. Yes, exactly. The cube that creates the memoria extracted this world from your complete selves. Oh crud. Oh man. In other words, you will have to fight stronger enemies without being at full strength. <laughs> this is gonna be rough. What? That's so unfair. But that's just how memoria works. Oh, this is so good. I can't wait. You gotta be kidding me. I don't really get it, but whatever. I just need to punch everything I see, right? Let's go. Yeah, I'm saying the same. I'm with Lovey. Let's go. Get me in there. <laughs> the objective function has been unlocked. Complete the objectives in the menu to receive rewards. Check your progress regularly. Oh, man, this game is like just getting so much more amazing. Grand logs are one of the rewards from objectives. They are a way to view summaries of past adventures of the crew. Check them out when you find them. Oh, cool. Okay. Man, there's so much to do. Okay, defeat Crocodile. Gather information. And, um, new objective added. Uh, so where's that Crocodile Bastard? I mean, around what time in Alabasta's history did we return to anyway? Figuring that out might be a good place to start. Leave the information gathering to me. I'm the most knowledgeable one here, after all. Oh, right. You used to be in Baroque Works. Yeah, I was going to say, uh, you were the villain? Okay, so what I'm going to do... We are going to save. And I'm going to end the episode right here. And we'll start a fresh episode. And we're just going to be going around checking it all out. So we're going to take it all in. So I can't wait to get started on this one. So as always, thank you so much for watching. You guys know what to do. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.